quay hộp giày Here we go again. Here we go yet again. Now, if you have my notifications on, you should have saw the post I made to my community tab on my YouTube channel. You can go to my YouTube channel and find the community tab next to videos and playlist tab. Click on there and I make updates to the channel for the people who have my notifications on you'll get the load of notification and you can see if I'm putting out a voting poll or updating you guys on whatever. Now, I put one up, I let y'all know the situation, but I have proof that, you know, I'm not just making stuff up. So, let's play the clip. Now, you normally don't see the behind the scenes stuff, but uh, I'm gonna show it this time. Some of y'all be thinking that I start series and then just cancel the series two videos in on purpose it's never on purpose it's always something behind the scenes that you don't see but i'm gonna show it to you now my computer is not dead it's over here chilling besides the smudges on windows which you can kiss my ass by the way i'm gonna get that later my pc is perfectly fine my pc is good you know i just gotta restart the computer but what happened this just went on a suicide mission and just killed itself this is my hard drive four terabytes four terabytes that is you know equivalent to four playstation 4 pros yeah so with that being said i lost everything lvp gone eli harris gone everything gone all my saved data my settings file my profile my you know my career files all the data that you could have and save was on this hard drive even the game, the game was downloaded on this hard drive. This hard drive, if you could smell the hard drive, you would know it's done. It smells like somebody threw it in a damn microwave for 10 minutes. Like you can smell that it's fried, it's burnt, it's done, it's GG's, it's over with. Now you're probably saying, oh, you can get your player back through the 2K support. No, no, I'm not even gonna waste my time. I'm on PC, I'm using mods, I'm using cyber faces and downloading stuff that 2K doesn't support because they're not the ones putting it out. And they're gonna see that I've been using that stuff and they're not even gonna mess with getting my mod players back. So I'm not even gonna waste my time. With that being said, I just had to show this behind the scenes stuff because y'all be swearing that I start series and just cancel it for no reason. No, 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 every year. I have stuff planned out and then it always goes bad every time. So you know what? I'm gonna just stop planning stuff. You know what? I'm gonna just stop saying I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do that. I'm bringing this person back. I'm, 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 I'm done talking. I'm gonna just do it. This is not 2K's fault. Not, not 1% is on 2K. This is all just technology going bad. That's it. So LVP is done. Eli Harris is done. I'm not about to restart two players. I'm not about to go through, what is that, 24, 30 games just to get back in the starting lineup with two players and then play even more games to get back to where I was. That's dead. I'm not doing that. So, I don't know what I'm going to do, but you will see after this clip. All right. Now, <laughs> it's always me, man. Like, I... I I don't even know what to say anymore. Every year something happens, whether my players is getting corrupted or fouls just mess, whatever it is, or I'm making the wrong build. Cause this year I blame myself for like two to three mistakes. I made the wrong builds around two to three times at the beginning of this year. And that's why I had to change Eli up a little bit here and there. So before we get into this attribute update and all that other stuff, player update, attribute upgrade, whatever you want to call it, I'm done planning stuff. I'm done making plans because every time I make plans, things go wrong. Oh, I'm about to do this. I'm going to do that. And then I'm going to do this. And then nothing goes according to plan. So I'm done planning stuff out. I'm done saying I'm going to do this. I'm going to do that. Whatever happens, happens. Like I said, I made the wrong build around two to three times at the beginning of 2K19. My very first build is this build, which I should have just stuck with. 
I made a playmaking sharpshooter. Sharpshooter second, playmaking first. Playmaking primary, sharpshooting secondary. This was my very first build. I played one game and was like, nah, this ain't it. I need to go back to my 2K18 build. I made a sharpshooting slasher. And this year, that build is garbage. I mean, horrible. It's good for like small forwards, but for a point guard or a shooting guard, trying to play my career with that build, nah, it was, it was garbage. So I messed that up. So that's already two times in a row. And then I believe I made up another build that I didn't like. So that's three times. In, so I blame myself for a few mistakes that I made this year. This last one, my hard drive just committing suicide. Yeah, that's not my fault. So this is the last player I'm making this year. I'm done after this. I, I'm, I'm completely done. I'm, I'm getting annoyed by all the times I got to keep changing stuff and changing things and it annoys y'all. I know it does because you're getting used to seeing this player and then something happens and then I got to switch and then you're seeing a new player. So thanks to my hard drive, just frying out, burning out, committing suicide, I guess. Eli Harris, LVP, no longer exists. We're going to bring back somebody who a lot of you guys loved and liked. I did as well. That man is... Adrian Hall, sharp shooting playmaker. I'm really like an 88 overall. Once I hit this cat breaker, I think I will be a 89, maybe, unless I get that two bar BS. But yes, Adrian LaFlame Hall, he's back. This is my last mile player for 2K19. I am done. I'm done. I I'm getting trolled. I'm getting hold. I'm getting annoyed. I keep just, I hate, trust me. Trust me, as much as you hate it, I hate it as well. I wanted to just stay on one team, one player, one to two players. But like I said, every time I make plans, things don't go right. So sharpshooting, playmaking, point guard, teammates with the Brody, my guy, Mo Bamba. I also got A.A. Ron Gordon, Gordon, Air Gordon, Aaron Gordon, man. This guy is athletic. Mo Bamba is athletic. Vucevic can shoot the two and the three. And he's decent under the basket. You got Jonathan Isaac, who's athletic. And I believe he can shoot as well. Fournier can shoot. Uh, Terrence Ross can do it all. Catch lobs, dunk, shoot the three. This team is actually pretty lit. They're young. They might not be high overalls. But this team is athletic and ready for highlights. It's going to be alley-oop nation in orlando i'm telling you i already played the game and it was against the blazers i'm not going to show you the box score because that's actually my next video and we got the bucks up next so on to the attributes my driving layup is a 77 it'll probably max out somewhere in the 80s i can dunk you know not like zach levine or russell westbrook type of dunks but I, you'll see in my next video against the Portland Trail Blazers, I dunked a few times. Your boy can dunk, so don't don't get it twisted. Mid range, yeah. Three point, I can hit the three. Ball handling, my ball control is on 88. It will max out at 92. As you already can tell, this is kind of the main build for Park. I'm already learning how to dribble like the Park guys that you love to watch. And I'm telling you, I might have to get out there on the park and start dropping some ankles. I, I might have to snatch a few ankles up and give y'all that park content as well. So I might start streaming again with the face cam and, and all of that. So just, just wait until I get my badges, wait until I master the dribbling, and then we're going to go to park and start taking over the park streets. Now, everything else, the rebounding, the steals, the blocks, the vertical, it's kind of pointless. My speed, that's going to increase over time. You see the rest. So, yeah, my dribbling, I can still do all the dribbles now, but it's not as fast because, you know, 92 dribbling, that's where it maxed out at. That's where I need it to be. I need it to be at 92 because once I get to 92, he dribbles a little faster and I can pull off the moves, moves that I really want to do. So, that's it for my attributes. Now, let's move on to my animations. Ah. <sighs> Everybody been asking me about the jump shot for my pure sharpshooter. I have a pure sharpshooter, deadly, and 
A lot of you have been asking me about my jump shot. I don't want to give my jump shot away because even though 2K said they don't patch jump shots, it's clear as day that they do. When people give their jump shots away, that leads into that shot being patched. So I think I'm going to hold off on my jump shot for now. But moving on to the crossovers and animations and dribble moves, Moving Crossover Pro 2, Behind the Back Pro 3, Moving Spins Pro 4, Moving Hesitations Pro 2, Standing Size Up Combos, Elite 20, you see the rest. This is actually the main dribble moves that you need for a playmaking sharp to dribble like your favorite park players out there on the park. Um, I actually took time to study dribble moves and I went in my mind court and just sat there for literally like 30 40 minutes doing dribble moves and putting the combos together and this is exactly how they do it so i'm telling you once i master the dribble moves and, and get my dribbling to 92 it's a wrap there's nothing really else to show like i said um this is my last player this is it i'm, I'm tired of starting over i'm tired of you know deleting series starting series and then two videos later something happens literally you're annoyed as well as me it's not just you that's pissed off because y'all y'all get used to a player and then something happens and i gotta restart and trust me it frets if it, it, it pisses me off more than it pisses some of you off trust me trust and believe and also i'm i'm done slacking i'm going hard this month so expect a lot of videos. Like I said, I'm dropping another, another video tomorrow. My first game with Adrian Hall will be up tomorrow against the Portland Trail Blazers, and that game was lit. I'm talking a game winner might have been made or missed. Hey, you just got to wait until tomorrow. My hard drive blew out and burnt. It, it was literally like burning. Like I could smell like the burning smell. Like you know how you overcook something? That's how my hard drive smelt. I came downstairs and my hard drive like literally fried itself. So I lost everything. And therefore, I had to come back to PlayStation 4. And um, Adrian Hall is now here. Eli Harris is no longer with us. LVP is no longer with us. I think I'm going to do an intro for Adrian Hall as well. So get ready for that. And uh, that might be about it. Stop for smashing that like button. Turn on them post notifications. I promise you, I'm going to make up for it. I'm going to put in the work. I'm going to be uploading a lot. I'm done slacking. It's on now. King team, Brazy team, stop for smashing that like button. Because we're about to go crazy.